Hey, what's up guys? It's Jeff Roditis here, and today I'm going to be doing a pretty cool fidget spinner unboxing. So, in this video, we're going to do two fidget spinners. Two fidget spinners. I'm going to be um, unboxing them and doing first looks, but I'm not going to time them because why do you, you don't need to know how long my fidget spinner um, can spin for because that's completely useless information. So, if you came here looking for a video of me timing a fidget spinner, you're not going to find it here. Um, anyways, so the first fidget spinner I have is this, like, brass one, and the second one I have is just a regular track fidget spinner. So let's go ahead and get on to just this first kind of regular one. So to get it out, you kind of have to, like, kind of have to, like, shake it out. Yeah, yeah. Oops. Yeah, it's not really uh, that easy to get out. It's pretty tightly packed in there, as you can see. But anyways, out of the package, you can already tell it looks very different from what most fidget spinners will look like. But uh, I really like, I really like them. They're like, they're very smooth. They're very smooth right out of the package. Like, it's, it just feels good to hold these ones. Well, they are pretty loud. They are pretty loud, but they're super smooth. And very fast. I really like just holding them and spinning them. But, that's pretty much all I really have to say about this one. So, let's go ahead and get on to this next one. So, the next one we have is just a, like a bar. Um, it's like a brass one. It comes in a really nice metal container for carrying it. It's also got some pretty nice packaging. It's a, uh, this is like gold colored. If you can kind of see that. And it's got like, some foam and stuff in there. So I don't think. Yeah, it's just got two layers of foam. But anyways, we don't need to talk any more about the foam or the box or anything. This fidget spinner is fairly good. Seems like I really I really like this one. Except my only problem with it is like when you're gonna try and like move it, like if you're moving it, it starts making a really annoying wobbly wobbly feel to it. Um, so you kind of have to hold it like in a, in a steady position without really moving it. It's, you can't, you can't wobble with this one or else it'll just stop. But overall it's a really good one. I like it. Um, but this one we can actually take it apart. Because it's got like several parts. These caps, these caps actually screw off. They don't just pop on. They're screw off caps. Like this. Mm. And if you can see that, it's got like, it's got a very small bearing, which we'll actually be taking out in a second. And another part that you can screw off right here to get the bearing out. But this is just a little screw piece. So, the bearing on this one, I don't really, I'm pretty sure it's just a metal ball bearing. Yeah, I think this is just a metal bar, ball bearing. Um, it doesn't look ceramic to me, but I could be wrong. But, it's most likely metal ball. And then this is just the, um, just the actual fidget spinner itself. It's, it's pretty good. It's, I really like this one, except for the noise levels. It makes a kind of ringing noise. Like, if you know what I mean. It's kind of, kind of, the, like, whenever you're spinning it, it's got... It's really almost annoying ringing sound to it. But I think that is all I really have to say to you guys. So I would like to thank you guys for watching this video. And if you did like it, please um, drop a like, leave a comment, and maybe even subscribe. So I will see you guys in the next video. Peace out.